All right, Dave Sports, what do we got? Okay, let's start with the NBA postseason where the Knicks lost game four to the Miami Heat last night, 109 to 101, despite 32 points and 11 assists from New York point guard Jalen Brunson. Didn't get a lot of help. In fact, Julius Randle ended up getting benched at the end of the game to not play the last two minutes. Wow. And once again, the Knicks just can't stop Jimmy Butler nor the Heat offense. Butler had 27 points, six assists, and 10 rebounds. And uh, just no answers for the Miami offense as the Knicks now trail three games to one. They're on the brink of elimination, but they're not. Done yet. One Game more. five is Wednesday in Madison Square Garden. So it is at home on their home court. Craig, it's in Manhattan. It. It's going on. They, they're going to have the support of the crowd again yeah. as the crowd has been unbelievable for the Knicks. You know, the Knicks fans are traveling everywhere. That's how you know that's captured the hearts of this area, Jersey I mean, and New York. That's a good sign, right? Well, yeah, because like you're seeing like tons of Knicks fans in Miami, yeah. and this is just after you saw tons of Knicks fans in Cleveland. Cleveland before that. Um, yeah, so uh, hopefully the Knicks can win tomorrow. I'm not ready to um, to end my uh, my Knicks fandom. I've been a, a fan for years and years, and this is the first good basketball we've had in about 20 years. Uh, meanwhile, the Lakers defeated the Warriors 104-101. to LeBron James, 27 points, 9 rebounds, and 6 assists. As the Lakers take a three games to one advantage over Steph Curry, uh, Steph Curry, and the Warriors, uh, who are the the defending champs. By the way, Jack Nicholson was spotted in the front row of the game. Oh, that's and, nice. Uh, yeah, he hadn't been going to any games since uh, apparently opening night of last season, but huh. now we've seen him twice. How's he look? In the past 10 days. He looks like Jack. Yeah. yeah I mean, he's, he's, he's 86 is what the uh, article said wow. in the post. Huh. So, you know, for 86, I, I think he looks good. I want to see what he looks I, like. I want to see, you know, I mean, Jack. 86, I'm going to be bedridden if I'm <laughs> even still alive. I know, I'm... So I think he looks good. I'll be a thumbnail. Yeah, so I'm working on that post. It'll be up there at WRAT.com if you want to go check that out in a little bit. Baseball, the Yankees took down the A's last night 7-2. to Glaber Torres and DJ LeMahieu were among the Yanks who homered last night. They improved to 19-17. and The Mets and Phillies were inactive tonight. The Mets go against the Reds in Cincinnati. And the Phillies play the Blue Jays in Philadelphia. Hockey, game four tonight for the Devils. Jersey faces the Carolina Hurricanes for game four of their Eastern semifinal series. I'm ready. Let's go. Eight Devils goals trail. in the last game. I yeah. mean, let's. The, the, I believe yeah. the, the Devils have caught something here. Devils trail two games to one, but are coming off that big game three victory in which they crushed the uh, Canes and, yeah, scored eight goals. So hopefully they continue that momentum. And finally, football, the Indianapolis Colts have requested that the uh, NFL looks into the Washington Commanders um, because they're accusing the Commanders of tampering. And an interesting tampering story here where the uh, Commanders apparently have been trying to reach out to four-time Pro Bowler Andrew Luck. Now, of course, Luck, a number one draft pick all those uh, years ago, four-time Pro Bowler, as we said he retired in 2019 at the age of 29, but because he retired, he still had three seasons on his contract, so technically he still belongs to the Colts. And so that's when they reached out to him back then? No, they're reaching out to him now. Now? Well, he's still under contract with oh. the Colts. Oh, I get he it. He can retire and not play with the Colts, but if he chooses to play, he's it's got to be with the Colts, the Colts huh. or they have to have compensation, uh, but a team can't reach out. Uh, but I just want to bring this up, that this is literally scandal number 8 billion for the Washington <laughs> yeah. Commanders. Let's see. There's sexual misconduct. Multiple. There's uh, insider trading. Mm -hmm. There is an owner who's blackmailing currently other owners. Daniel Snyder said, if you guys try to force me out of the league, I'm going to reveal dirt on every owner right, 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 in the right. NFL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had to get taken in front of Congress. Now let's throw tampering. What a disgraceful organization the Washington Commanders has yeah. become. Damn. That was like one of the best NFL organizations in the 80s. Dirty pool, baby. Dirty, Dirty pool. pool is right. That's your quick look at sports.